fresh you boy and play. It's raining, which is normally pretty bad, but we're on Saturday. Probably day of video games. Let's get this round. Alright, it's about to jump into the uh, second ever Fortnite stuff in Smash. Uh, I am for Fortnite. Really excited, it's gonna be great. Gonna take a dub. Alright, so we just got to the arena early. Broadcast goes live in I think about two hours. It's a lot different than last year. They got like Little screens in front that show your elim, so mine's gonna be zero the whole time. This is the format for the solos. It's pretty traditional Fortnite scoring. At the HyperX booth, they're all voting to see who's gonna win. Oh, look at that. They got a poll. Look at that. They got a poll the HyperX. McCreamy's not even playing, he dipped out. <laughs> Oh, he's not coming? Yeah, he dipped out. Alright, so we just got no one to meet Green HyperX. Now we're gonna head over to uh, get prepped, hopefully get ready to stream, and we're prime. Alright, about to jump into the prime. We love Fortnite. Uh, strategy for game one is to land plus and pop. Oh, we're going PP. We do love PP. And we're just going to game. We own PP. Unless one of the Chinese or Japanese teams decides to. We have a problem there. And I'm oh. the, the bots I'm carrying. Uh, the competition. They're all trash. We're winning, I'm winning two, two years in a row. you got to have the toxic mentality. Yeah. 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 Enjoy. I'm usually not toxic. First, first fortnight I've been given a task that is to heal and annoy. Heal and annoy. Not annoy us. Not annoy us. Annoy the thing. Yeah. Yeah. Heal, annoy, sit there with an AR. Look at the man, Mr. Fresh Asian himself. I think soon could be uh, actually Mr. Fresh. Guys, thank you. We've got one of the biggest names going around inside Margaret Court Arena. Lachlan, ladies and gentlemen. Kids, what do you think of this? <laughs> now, they have been cheering for you since you arrived. How are you feeling, my man? Feeling pretty pumped. Uh, yeah, good crowd turnout today. Love to see it. Um, we've got a pretty good squad going. We've got myself, Anshui, and of course, Fresh. Uh, he won the Prime last year, so. Hopefully we can do it again. That's a strong team, right? Yeah, it's it's one of the stronger teams. Uh, obviously, me and Fresh did a lot of World Cup together, so hopefully we can bring that back and uh, put it out there today, yeah. We're nearly ready to get stuck in, but I've got to ask you about your outfit. Man, this is fresh. Tell us about it. What's going on? Uh, this is just the merch line. This is uh, my clothing line, Powered by Lachlan. Uh, it's my last name, so... Yeah, it's just a uh, power, little electric bolt there. Love to see it. All set up, ready to go. Team number one. Yeah, we'll play some park. We're ready. Yeah, what's up? back in Pleasant Park though. It looks like another team has rolled up. We're looking at Fresh. He does take some shots. It looks as though Vinny's team is actually trying to push them out of Pleasant and take it for them for themselves. Yeah, they're a scary team, but they're choosing to back off and Fresh is leading the charge there. You can see in the bottom right on the mini map, Fresh is that front triangle. Who is pushing them down? Bad. Fresh is not letting these guys get away. He doesn't have a sniper, unfortunately, but he does have that AR and he's gonna take a couple of shots onto George, hit him for 30 shield. His shield does get ripped off. It is uh, now his turn to take a little bit of damage. He is trying to build up and ramp up, reinforce that as he goes. Uh, we are back over here uh, with uh, Lachlan. He is taking some shots. So is Mr. Fresh Asian. They're a little bit low on shields right now. Zone is going to start moving in about 15 seconds, but they are on the slower side, so they will have time to finish this engagement. Yeah, they're playing this incredibly well. Fresh is taking it slow. He finds the angle on X2. If he can take that X2 here, which he does, that's a huge turning point. Fresh's team now has the numbers advantage. It's three versus two. Trying to find these angles. Enshui pushing in to close out this fight. 
Fresh just holding that high ground, making sure he doesn't get caught out. If Fresh goes down here, Vinny's on low ground with no shield. Fresh wants to finish this, finally does, he takes it down. Fresh, Enshway, and Lachlan getting three eliminations, and now they need to push in the zone nice and safe. That was a phenomenal play by them. That was really, really well done. Okay, so throughout the games, I'm gonna be doing a little bit of a post-gameplay analysis because obviously the broadcast team didn't pick up everything we did. So I'm gonna go through some of that in this. So pretty much this is the first fight of the tournament. We've been holding these guys out of the zone for a long time. Uh, Fresh is trying to get an angle on them and I get a cheeky little shot here on this guy. Get a knock. From there, it's pretty much me going, knocked, knocked, knocked. And then Fresh just runs through, takes the rest out. I think, yeah, you got Exu there and then we slow play to get Vinny. Um, and then we just walk out three easy points. You'll love to see it. And now we've got shield, but what we don't have is AR bullets and uh, that really hurts. You can see uh, Mr. Fresh Asian's team here kind of trading, splitting of mats to make sure that everyone is prepared going into the final zones because with only 500 of each resource, you can expend those so quickly. Yeah, and I mean, you gotta look at this squad right now. We have Fresh on top of Jinx, who was actually his squad and trio mate during the last FNCS. So I don't know, maybe they can sense each other a little bit. You have Lachlan on top of Molly there, who are also both part of the Click team. So this is a very uh, tight knit group right now. It'll be interesting. Not really sure how much help that is going to end up being. We can see Lachlan oh. going down to five health, taking shots from behind, is using his build to try to get out of this very sticky situation. He has two vantage bazookas in his inventory that he is going to try to get off, but he's able to get two shots up, unfortunately, getting him 30 health, but does take a little bit more damage. Oh my goodness. Good. Lachlan, yeah. though, Lachlan and Troy back in it. Like I said, Lachlan is showing a lot of intelligence right now. He is a competitive player who has been playing for a very long time. That decision to just hide, wait till the team's rotated past, and then rotate late has proved incredibly useful. Okay, yeah. so at this point, Fresh is down. It's just me and Enchway. It is legitimate shambles. I have no builds left, pretty much. Uh, I'm just like pickaxing. I think I have five or six builds. I'm trying to stay alive for placement points because in this tournament, placement points were stacked. Every placement was worth five, uh, every placement was worth three points. Um, which total up to five more points than a normal game if you win. And so as you can see here, I'm just rotating with zero mats, uh, trying to just get through best I can. I did pretty well. It's just the first game was super stacked and everybody was trying super hard. Ench goes down around here. It's just me. I got the bandage cannon at least. And so this guy builds over me right here and I just get jump fatigue. I couldn't quite get the amount of mat. Like, I couldn't quite get over it because I got jump fatigue. So I go down there game one. We just get three points. All right, first game one, a uh, little synopsis. Uh, Fresh got Elim a little bit early in the late game. We were pretty much shambles. Me and Enchi though, stayed alive. Didn't get any Elims, didn't get any placement points, but we got three points. We got three points from that team we took out. So hopefully next round, I couldn't hear Fresh as much, so hopefully next round we're just gonna come in. Mitch won though. Mitch and Luda won the first game, so you love to see that. Um, now we're getting into game two. Alrighty, so game number two, definitely, no doubt about it, my weakest game that I played. Um, unfortunately, I wasn't able to do much in this game at all. So now it's a 3v2, Zexro and Jakey versus me and Fresh. Uh, I get some decent shots on these guys, but if I fast forward a little bit, I think it's just a big standoff that goes into zone fighting. Um, Ench is just holding a little bit. I'm holding as well. Just trying to get as many beams. Fresh is storm fighting. It's kind of yikes at this point because it's 2v1. Uh, Fresh gets a good hit on him there, and he ends up taking Jakey out, which is huge. So that's just Zex and me and Fresh. I beam Zex there. He is so low right now, but I'm pretty sure he ends up getting away barely. Locking on the high ground with Enchway and Fresh, I would have to assume they're going to close this one out. They are in the best position possible. Guess who it is? Lachlan's still alive with Mr. Fresh Asian, and they have ultimate high ground right now. So the fan favorites here, Mr. Fresh Asian and Lachlan in a great position to close this one out. And then Fresh, Enchway, and Lachlan tapping across. Unfortunately, Lachlan's by himself now. Enchway and Fresh gets knocked down. This is where things will get really ugly for people like Enchway. Keep and Lachlan goes down. They go from oh, being no. in the best position to the worst because they were just that little bit too far apart. But then again, Fresh can close this one out. He's good enough to do it. As I say, that 39 takes down Bumper, though, so he'll get the Siphon on that elimination. 89 health has the minis now, but it's down to him. Enchway and Lachlan have both gone down. All right, so at this point, we get the moving zone, and I actually build out the wrong way initially. I think it's that way, but it's actually going up the hill back that way. And so Fresh was like, oh, you got to top. And now I'm too late to top. So I'm like, oh, no, I got to catch up on the top. So I do like a double wide one. And then fortunately, I get RPG'd. I miss the build there to like break my fall, and I take full damage game two. You do hate to see it, uh, but that's okay because as you're about to see, Mr. Fresh Asian 
is clutch. Think there'd be anyone behind him because Fresh has these fish. So right now, Fresh is taking a large amount of storm damage, but he has those orange fish that he can use for 50 health back within half a second. Symmetrical now battling the NA Pro as well. Zay goes down. Our current team in second. Fresh is on the high ground. We see Symmetrical down there as well. Elevate, Twisty. They're going for right now. Three teams alive. Five players. And such a heads-up play for Mr. Fresh Asian, waiting for Zay and taking high ground back. That was 1,000 IQ for Mr. Fresh Asian, who completely flipped this round on its head and regained control to win this game. Mr. Mr. Fresh Asian is playing near perfect Fortnite right now. And guess what? We got Symmetrical versus Mr. Fresh Asian in one versus one. It's good old fashioned. It's OCE versus NA right now. Fresh can close this one out. He was so modest earlier today that he doesn't think he can stack up against these international pros, and I think he can. It's a 1v1. Symmetrical look at the oh! comes out, and Fresh closes it out. The victor of last year's Pro Am coming out on top today. 23 points total. They come back in game two. Can you believe what we just saw? An epic game number two and an epic finish from Mr. Fresh. Asian who just played so well. Let's see a freshy boy gets banned. Apparently he's getting banned. I am banned. I'm a good boy. All right, so game three, pretty good. Uh, probably the second best game I played. So in this game, we spot Mully and Jinx. So we're pretty much trying to fight these guys. Unfortunately for these guys, they actually had the celebrity dip out, so they were playing 2v3. So right now it's fresh 2v1ing uh, Jinx and Mully, but we took out all of Jinx's shields, cut down his build. Fresh is doing a 2v1 right now. Um, I get the backside of Molly and I miss every shot, but that's okay because Karmabax comes back around for a double headshot on Jinx. You'll love to see it. That's some controller aim right there. And then so moving forward, we set up in these little boxes in here, and this is where we pretty much just fragged out. Like, we were getting tons of E-limbs. We killed Brody and all those players. Like, we just stood here and sprayed everybody coming in. Got that cheeky knock on Brody. Love to see it. Easy E-limb for the boys. And we, we just racked up so many kills here. Like, you'll see Fresh and everybody just... Like, I'm just getting tags. Just holding them in. We had so much AR ammo. Just dead set. Holding it down. Not letting anybody in. Look at that. Fresh just picked up two kills there. Doing bit. Um, we are over at Lachlan and his team right now as well. They are taking shots. Things are starting to heat up. We are in the fifth zone. Things are going to get wild very quickly. You're spot on. And so further on, we're moving into zone. Uh, we've got pretty much height at this point, but then Epic Whale tries to take it off us. He does a pretty good job of that. Me and Fresh combo here. He gets magma. I tag up the rest of him. There's Baker Boy going up. He was probably the celebrity, so we probably should have gone for that. But we get stuck down here. And you think I'd learn from last game to not build too high. Uh, me and Fresh are 2v one Epic Whale here. I think Epic Whale just backs off because he sees that we're Epic Gamers. And so I'm topping here at height. Very smart. I jump down. I fall. And I die. I get full damage again. Not Epic. And it's okay, though, because Fresh going clutch up again and get us some placement points. One thing that absolutely has to be seen here. Us rotating in and uh, Enchwe. Keep in mind, our celebrity, all right? He's like, don't worry, boys, I hit mean snipes. And I was like, all right, let's see it, boy. Let's see these mean snipes. You know, is that is a cheeky song? Oh, that's a headshot snipe on the guy who got second in the Fortnite World Cup from our celebrity. Yeah, that's the type of stuff the Pro-Am is for, you know what I mean? Just like that. Like, he just does that casually. Andre was going off in the comms. He's like, I saw him any good. I'm like, yeah, kind of good second World Cup. Technically the best player here, like casually headshot snipes. You'd love to see it. A's, NRG, 100 Thieves, so many great organizations still alive here, and their players are representing well. TSM as well with Zexro on screen. Mr. Fresh Asian, though, of Renegades doing it well with three eliminations to his name right now and high ground in a good position. Under some duress right now for an RPG coming at him. And he's going to be able to almost get a tag on Magma. Ooh, that edit, though, ends up getting Magma down, gets all of his loot, gets the help as well. Uh, he is going to have to prepare because there are still 11 teams and the 17 players alive. So we have hit the first threshold for placement points. Alrighty, so game number four, the final game. And this one is a lot of pressure. I do spot that Llama early as well, by the way. So I loot up, get my Llama. But the big thing about this one is that we are 10 points behind first place that being zate and whatnot um so we knew that we had to frag out if we wanted to take the dub on the final game and let's just say this little llama you know maybe they put in pleasant park for us who knows but you guys sells a cheeky llama we stand corrected they ended up fighting they yeah. fought they fought once they game near them Rel's trying to save himself here am i is that the right decision too because you're playing against a lot of celebrities who maybe aren't as experienced in fortnite you can take some early eliminations you can play yeah. more aggressive that's the right strategy yeah especially if you're benji fishy Ooh. arguably a top five top ten player in the world meanwhile mr fresh asian you hear the crowd react pick up picks up an elimination alongside lap lachlan so yeah. the first fight we end up taking is against rel he's obviously on lannan's team but we don't see lannan anywhere um so we were just trying to push him 2v1 style. 
I get a nice little dink on him, and then we just go super aggressive on him. Fresh take in one side. Classic World Cup pinch. You, you love to see a little bit of teamwork, you know what I'm saying? And uh, then I just try and rail him and uh, edit down. Bang. See you later, Rel. Nice playing a video game. Obviously, it's 2v1, so I'm not trying to say I'm better than him in any means. Uh, we know that Lannan's here, but I actually want to know where he was right now because we were looking for him after this, and we were like, oh, we can get a free point here, and we needed a free point. Where was he? Okay, it turns out he wasn't even in our render distance, so... Landon, a big team player there. <laughs> Time, Jinx, Australian pro player here locally. Ooh, he's going to be beefing up a fresh's team here. Jinx is now, he's trying to hold this with Benson. Mully's gone down or he is currently knocked. He hasn't been finished just yet. Benson only has about 20 Ooh. health. Jinx needs to pull something off big here. He's going up against his old trio and squad mate. Fresh, as I say, that Fresh is above him, letting Ooh. him know he was there. Jinx didn't see him, but Fresh says hello. Peekaboo says Mr. Fresh Asian with a heads up play on Jinx. Picks up the elimination after. So again, and now pick it up, Jinx. Oh, oh no. no. Some fun here, some disrespect no. Oh my gosh. And then so from there, we get into a little bit of another fight with Molly and Jinx uh, from the last game. So I'm trying to push up while Fresh takes a flank. I think he just took down Molly there. I'm not sure. No, it looks like Fresh is still very much doing most of it. I think I got a cheeky dink here on Jinx. Oh, it goes to the snipe. Yeah, so Molly. So yeah, Molly died to Fresh there. Uh, we just got Jinx left. I got, yeah, there we go. Cheeky dink. And we're all just AR spamming him, making his life not very epic. I missed that, which is not very uh, clean. Fresh just goes in, going for the triple punish, and uh, yeah, Jinx is down. Their teammate is AFK, so yeah, we were looking for that. That was kind of confusing, though. And he's finished off there. JL Mock not looking too great, but trying to spray that fight out. The RPG shot comes out. It's Fresh's team pushing forward 41 points. They are playing so aggressively now. Honestly, at this point in the game, I have to pick Fresh's team as the favorites because they are playing so aggressively, just walking through people. Fresh has oh. found his stride. He is pushing forward on Babs, and I can't imagine Babs is going to survive this one. And you have to know that Babs is hurt right now, so Mr. Fresh Asian is not going to let loose like a shark in water right now, trying oh to finish him. He's going to take out Thanasi. Fresh is not done yet. Babs alive. Babs hurt. Babs about to get taken out. And yes, he does. Mr. Fresh Asian and Lachlan do it again. Another great performance from the Click Crew. Here we go. As you get to late games, that means the circles are getting smaller and smaller. You see these builds, these tunnels start to come. Every player is just trying to safely rotate into the next circle, which at the bottom right of your screen, you can see where that half-half zone is, as Oziantic just mentioned. Ooh, a great shot put in by Mr. Fresh Asian. And he's going to continue his spree. Picks up a sixth elimination. That's the most in one game that I have seen Ooh. so far. Yep. Mr. Fresh Asian continues to play perfect yep. at the Australian Open. And then, so over here was quite interesting. We're rotating to zone on dead side. We got these guys pushing us on the back. This Cloud9 guy was W King the whole lobby, so I was kind of scared. Ench nearly goes down there, but he runs away. Gets away with barely anything. Fresh hits. Uh, uh, Fresh gets a good hit on uh, one of the boys, and you'll see here, it's actually in the broadcast. Again, the double pinch strat, you love to see it. Uh, we're both taking the walls. I grabbed the wall, but unfortunately missed my shots here. But Fresh is able to take off the other guy. Um, so we get a free Elam there. And then RPG in. All the pressure from all the sides. I'm getting pressured a little bit now too. So I don't know if we actually get this one. So I'm looking for angles. Keep in mind, like, we know we got to win this. I see my boy go down. Ench is out. It's just being fresh. Ench is on one elim. I'm on two. Fresh is on seven. We're like, well, that's ten elims. Like, this is it. This is the game. I'm looking for a pick. I'm not really seeing it. And so I'm giving Fresh all of my stuff, like most of my mats and stuff. He gets that value RPG. We got a knockout of that. I'm down to 22, so I'm kind of freaking right now that I'm going to die. I got the Scython just in time on that, that Fresh went and W keyed for. Otherwise, I would have died. Uh, I'm not too sure how this ends here for me. I think the guys up top just keep on beaming. Yeah, no one's letting me go here. I think I died a zone, actually, from that beam. Yeah, you hate to see it when you just miss it by that much. It's the worst thing ever. But that's okay, though, because we have the... Mr. Fresh Asian. Chances and Luda still sticking together as well. So they're looking great. And Fresh picks up another elimination. Eats the flopper. And look at him. He's in zone, but he's got that extra flopper too. There's a med kit there. I don't think I'll have time to use it. Fresh is still alive. 56 points. He has nine eliminations. Three on Lachlan, who has gone down though. He's got no more health meds. He needs to push out. He needs this elimination so bad. He, he gets the siphon. He has a 61 health now with the extra 50. Taking down Richie. He's pushing forward. 25 health. The edits come out. He's getting stuck a little bit. But now he's moving forward. Three teams alive. Damn. You gotta think this is a one versus one right now. Really, and Benji uh, Fish is going to come out on top as Aletha gets dropped to low ooh. ground. But ultimately, Benji Fishy and Aletha were in such a perfect position to close that one out. Our second and first place teams are... Oh, Benji Fishy in second. There you go. Lachlan, Mr. Fresh Asian.
And Emsway coming through. Fresh back to back. AO Summer Smash Pro Am Champion. And they're going to pick up the carrier of their team, Mr. Fresh Asian. Congratulations, you are the back to back Australian Open Summer Smash featuring Fortnite champion for the Pro Am. Two times in a row he does it. So yeah, that was the Fortnite Pro-Am. Obviously, massive success. We went at home and took home the dub. Of course, obviously, goes without saying. A massive shout out to my boy, Mr. Fresh Asian. O on brand, carried the boys. Uh, I just wish I didn't die to full damage those two games. That kind of really sucked. Uh, but I think we definitely pulled through as a team. Ench doing his bit. I was doing my bit. We all did a bit. Fresh did a lot more than us. But 2020 AO Pro-Am champs, you love to see it. Uh, and if you're wondering what happened to the solos, me and Fresh didn't do very well. <laughs> we both are on the last page of the leaderboard, but that's okay though because we won the pro-am and that's what matters